Hello and welcome back to another episode on my hardcore. So if you watched the end of the last episode, you would have heard me say that this episode is going to be a bit different and I'm going to explain why right now. So I did a poll on Instagram and most people voted for yes and that was shall I make my hardcore into a clue only. Um, I'm going to do this episode as like a, a test and if people like it then I'll do more but as it stands, I've got some beginner clue scrolls and easy clue scroll. Well, I've got one of each right here. So I'm going to go do them. But basically, I just want to, to know like what people's thoughts were if I should make a clue only hardcore. It, it will be carrying on with this. But what it will entail is like I'll just be doing clues. And if you don't know what I mean, then go and watch Only Trails on YouTube and watch his series. And that will explain more like in depth of how I would do this but I'm gonna go ahead and get some clue scrolls and I'll see you in a minute obviously the main objective of the series would be just to have fun like for me personally I find it really fun it's really entertaining to watch everybody loves clue scrolls the only problem I have is law rooms I'm literally out so I'm gonna have to take another wilderness trip unless I get a casket here and it gives me law runes maybe because that can happen from easy clues is this the casket? Yeah, it is. Right, so I'm just going to open this real quick. Okay, no law runes. I'm going to have to take a wilderness trip. Is this going to be the end when this lever gets pulled? There could be someone waiting for me. Yes, I'm brave. Okay, we Gucci. We Gucci, boys. For now, anyway, until I get to the mage bank. Okay, we made it. Nice. Let's get some law runes. Hopefully I get some law runes from uh, clues because I just spent all my money on law runes and now I've got 57. So hopefully I start getting some from some clues, but I'm going to move on and start banging some out. You know what's going to help me out loads here? Some rings of jeweling. So, I mean, I can only make three because I've only got three cosmic runes, but that's better than no rings of jeweling. Cheeky crafting level right there. So instead of opening on all the clues one by one, I'm going to stack a few up, but I've actually got this hard clue. So I'm going to see if I can do it or at least how many steps I can do anyway. No, it was going so well. I, I literally finished three steps on it. This is step number four. Fire battle staff, blue DI chaps, room full arm. I mean, I'm going to keep hold of it for now. And when I've got these stuff, if it's not too far in the future, I can actually go and do this pretty easy. So... I'm going to get some beginner and easy caskets now and then move on to opening them. So killing goblins to get beginner clues gives me an excuse to get my defense up. So I'm starting at 34 defense with one beginner casket in the bank. That's literally four goblins in. Uh, okay then, well, let's get this done I suppose. Am I just being lucky or what? But I literally just got another clue scroll after about five more goblins after getting that first one i don't know what the drop rate is but it's pretty good at the minute just about to hit 35 defense there we go very nice got three beginners now is oh okay never mind yeah i've got three caskets oh wait i didn't know you could get easy clue scrolls from goblins well i guess i'm doing that one as well I'm pretty sure I can buy a green hat and a cream robe top from Canifis, right? I'm going to have to double check that. So I did that step and I've just got another one. I've got to go back and buy more different colours, but I can get them easy enough anyway. Just missed getting 36 defence. What the fuck is a goblin butt? Never ever seen that before. Just at a exam, is this going to be a herb law level? Maybe. 345. No, so close to a level. Right then, I've got 10 beginner caskets. So I'm going to open all of these. And once I've done these, I'm going to move on to some easies. I've already got that one there. But I'm going to go thieve hand members to get the easy caskets. But for now, let's just open these beginner caskets. So I don't really know what I'm after here. I'm going to... oh. Law runes. Law runes are always good. Like, I've, I've used so many just doing these few. Uh, um, not a good start, is it? <laughs> I 
that was uh, a complete load of trash. But now we're going to move on to some easies. Just got 37 thieving from the hand members. We might have to switch this up. I'm on 103 thieves and it's a 1 in 50 to get an easy. I still have not got a single one. And hand members, if you know from experience, are the worst thing to pickpocket because they have such a fucking low chance of actually pulling it off. Watch me get one now. Well, I'm no, okay. Right, I'm, I'm going to maybe go to 200. If I haven't got one by then, I'm going to figure out a different way. Hey, you. Yeah, you. You want to give me a clue scroll, bitch? Okay, no. I, I was just trying that to see if it worked. That's my second thieving level since being here and I haven't got a single clue score yet like is uh, game hello are you broken 184 pickpockets one in 50 chance please give me a clue score please right that's it I'm five times over the drop rate I'm getting out of this shithole unless this bitch gives me clue score right now no I keep going to the fail come on give me a clue score uh, <sighs> right I'm finding another way I'm sick of this so, according to the RuneScape wiki, Gourmet Implins are 1 in 25. So, in order to get Gourmet Implins, I need 28 Hunter. So, it looks like I'm going to Puro Puro. Who's ready for a Hunter montage? God damn, so that clip that you just watched that took 30 seconds took me just over two hours to get those levels. So I hope you really have fun watching that. It deserves a like at least for that. <laughs> but now I'm going to head over to Puro Puro to start catching some imps. So I've been catching baby and gourmet imps and I just got a beginner clue scroll. But I'm going to keep going until I've got an easy as well. I literally got it, the clue after, I mean the catch after I got that beginner. So um, I've got them both now. I'm just going to fill my invent up with some more gourmet implants and go do these clues. It's time to start stacking up some easy caskets. I've got this one and this beginner, but I'm going to stack a few up. Ah, so I've got to grind a blue wizard robe here. So I might be here for a while killing some wizards. 37 defense killing some wizards. Yes, thank fuck for that. I've, I've been here for about 10 minutes, killed about 35, but we've got it now, so let's carry on with this clue. This next step requires a coif, so it looks like I'm getting 20 range real quick. I'm already 19, so it shouldn't really take you that long. Turns out you need 38 crafting to make a coif, so I'm stringing flax into bowstrings. Right, we've got 37 crafting and we've got poison chalices here, so I can try and get a plus one crafting boost. So let's hope for that and then make the coif. Oh, right, we've done it straight away first time, so that is what I want. And boom, just as easy as that. Now I've got one beginner casket and three easies. I'm going to go back to the hand members for a bit and see if they bring me any luck. Oh my god, I got one. I was beginning to lose hope, but there we go. Easy clue scroll, let's go do it. Right, because I'm almost out of lore runes and I've got these caskets right here, I'm just going to open them up. So I've got one beginner, five easies. So let's start with a beginner. Ugh, fucking cabbages, man. And now let's do the five easies. Black. Wait, did I just... I just accidentally opened two. What the fuck? That first one was so many teleporter scrolls. I, I didn't even see it. It just double clicked. Ooh. They're nice. And and that's tea, actually. Uh, that's trash. A lot of teleports, though. And still the body and a black axe. So um, we've got a bit of fashion scape on the go right here. That, that doesn't even look that bad, that whole, uh, that whole outfit. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to probably carry on getting more clues. So I know I said in the last clip that I was going to go and get some more caskets, but I'm actually going to end this episode here. Um, 
in my favourite place, the Ham Hideout. I actually don't. Uh, no, I hate this place. What am I on about? But no, like I said at the beginning of this episode, this this whole episode was going to be like a test run. And if you if you liked it, like if you want to see more, then please go ahead and tell me. Otherwise, I'm just going to carry on with my hardcore as a normal hardcore, like doing normal hardcore stuff. You know, I'll have to bang out a bunch more quests and stuff like that. But the further along I get in this series, the more exciting it will be. At the minute, obviously, I'm only doing beginner and easy clues. Um, eventually, I'll move on to medium. And then if I'm still alive at that point and people do want to see this, it's going to be hard, elite and master clues. So, like, please, please, please go ahead and tell me and please subscribe to see more content. Like, if, if you tell me in the comments what you want, the chances are I'm more than likely going to do it. But I'm going to leave this episode here. I'm going to upload this and leave it for a bit. I'm going to play on my main for like a week or so because I've got an idea to do on my main. Um, so for for like a week to 10 days maybe, there probably won't be another hardcore series uh, episode, sorry, unless this blows up a bit and people really do want to see more. If people are telling me that they want to see more of this, I will happily, happily make more. But I don't want to just be uploading this for the sake of it and like not getting much pro because it does take a lot like it's harder to film these episodes than it is to to film just a normal hardcore episode because I've, obviously i've got to go out my way to get the clues but like i said it'll get more entertaining the more and more i go medium clues hard clues elite clues so if you want to see more tell me please go ahead and hit that subscribe button tell me that you've subscribed Leave a comment, say you want more, or just carry on as normal, and I will see you next time. Peace.